Hey everyone, it is Danny, and welcome to this update video on what is happening. And so I hope that you're all having a really wonderful day thus far. And so we'll be taking a look at what is expected across various sections of the Caribbean as you're going to be progressing throughout today. We'll be looking at what is currently taking place across some areas. And so before I go into details, please do subscribe if you haven't done so already and tap the notification bell so that you never miss an important update. And of course, to show your support for the channel, channel you can leave a like on this video all right and so let's go ahead and get straight into what is happening and so as we take a look at parts of the uh eastern caribbean here and a portion of the atlantic we can see that uh things are a bit messy we see some inclement weather here and there we definitely have some activity moving into portions of the lesser antilles coming out of the atlantic and of course along the intertropical convergence zone uh that is where we have quite a bit of activity taking place we see a lot of deep convection within the area and so of course where you have those areas of deep convection where you see those brighter colors those oranges those reds uh that is where we would typically see more more shower and thunderstorm activity taking place and so now let's go ahead and take a look at what is happening uh, across portions of the lesser antilles and so here we're taking a look at the current satellite imagery here and we see that uh we have a lot of cloudiness really uh maybe in association with some showers moving across some areas we see most of that activity taking place in the vicinity of martinique and saint lucia uh and we have a lot more heading in and even looking at the visible satellite imagery as the day comes to a start in the western hemisphere we definitely see all that cloud cover and all that activity being carried into the uh, Caribbean by those trade winds and so that is going to increase the chances for some shower activity across different areas as we're going to be progressing into uh, later today and so let's take a look at those totals and and we're seeing here that uh, most of the rainfall for today in the eastern Caribbean is anticipated in the vicinity of the Lesser Antilles of course where we have all that activity so we see that it is Dominica, Guadeloupe as well as Martinique and St. Lucia that are expected to uh, have the highest totals for today in terms of rainfall activity and so other surrounding areas such as St. Vincent, Grenada, the Grenadines also going to Barbados we're not seeing too much expected today but of course uh as for the aforementioned areas, they're going to have those, uh, all, a little bit of that activity making its way into the region and resulting in an increased possibility of rainfall. And so now as we take a look at what is happening for the rest of the Caribbean here, we're seeing that uh, there is quite some activity that is seen mainly in the northwestern Caribbean, of course, uh, where we have what is left of a cold front in the area uh, dissipating really and a lot of cloud coverage seen for portions of Central America as well as the Cayman Islands and even for Cuba. But as for other areas such as Hispaniola and Jamaica, nothing too intense going on. Should be a sunny day for the most part, of course there is going to be that chance of some shower activity especially in the afternoon hours as for the rainfall totals for the western caribbean here we're seeing that we're seeing that of course uh most of that rainfall activity is going to be offshore and in the vicinity of the gulf of honduras so uh not seeing where too much is expected inland but of course coastal areas could see some increased rainfall activity we also see that some rainfall is definitely expected in the vicinity of Grand Cayman. And then as we head to the Central Caribbean, for the most part, we're seeing here that as I said, nothing too much is happening and not much is really expected here. Maybe just a bit of rainfall across sections of Jamaica and uh, Cuba as well as Hispaniola on the whole. We, even for Puerto Rico, we're seeing that uh, not much is anticipated as we're going to be progressing into this afternoon. And looking in the vicinity of the Bahamas, maybe some uh brief showers here and there but nothing too intense guys and so that is really what is expected as we're going to be heading into later today across the caribbean and so of course guys i'm going to be keeping you updated once it is necessary and if you have any questions you can leave them down in the comments of course and you can also share your thoughts there and remember to always be otherwise and i will keep you updated as time goes by